Tim Drake continues his search for the Batman in Robin number 176. Welcome back, Zappers. I'm Devin Curry with Shazap.com, your online video source for comic book news and reviews. Today on Shazap, we're taking a look at Robin number 176. Now, this story arc is so good. I mean, we've got action and intrigue and detective work. This is a great story, and it really showcases everything that makes Robin such an amazing character. He's strategizing and playing the game and figuring out what's going on with Batman. Now, I wasn't sure last issue why they were showing us the part of 52 when Batman goes into the cave, except to maybe show us where Batman's craziness may have begun. But a new reason, actually a couple of new reasons, appeared in this issue. The first is Robin is telling us when he kind of dropped the Boy Wonder title and evolved into his own man. He developed a new suit, became a bit darker, and started to kind of get intimidation going as one of his weapons. Now in a way, working with Nightwing and no Batman around, he also started to imagine the scenario that's now unfolding in front of him of a Gotham City without Batman. Now there's a line where Robin really shows us who he's become when Officer Harper asks if an out of control Batman is too dangerous for the police, isn't it too dangerous for Robin? And he simply answers, no. Tim Drake is the first Robin that you actually believe has the potential to be better than Batman himself. The question is, when will he need to be? Thanks for tuning in to Shazap.com. I'm Devin Curry. Remember, you can blog about this issue and anything else we've got going on on the homepage, and you can follow me at twitter.com backslash Devin Curry. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.